been really good to to be here, um, representing this football club, and I've enjoyed getting to know like, my new teammates and team, who have made it very easy for us to settle in. So, yeah, the first few weeks, month month or so, has has been good, but hopefully still more to come. As I would have, have expected, even some things are even better. You know, I think I've I've settled in really well, um, which is which is always the, the the hardest thing. And you're coming to a different country, different players, different teams, is trying to settle as quickly as possible. But like I said, the the players, the staff, the fans, everyone has made that as very smooth as possible, if you like. Who helped you the most? To be honest, they've all been so good. You know, like really, really good. Um, you know, I knew. Stephen Bergwijn a little bit before we've got mutual friends and stuff, so he's helped us a lot. Stephen Berghaus has been a big help, I think, with his, you know, again, mutual friends and they made it easier and he's closer to my age <laughs> than the rest, <laughs> so that makes it a lot easier. So he's been um, he's been a massive help for, for us settling in as well. Everyone's been so good with us and, and they made me feel at ease so I can be myself. Yeah. You know, sometimes when you come into a new environment, it's quite hard to be yourself. You know, a lot of things that are different and you're trying to adapt yourself to certain things that you're maybe not used to. But I feel very much myself, especially in the last few weeks. So that's down to, to my teammates and the, and the, and the staff and, and the fans and everybody around the club, really. So um, I just want to, again, try and help as much as I possibly can on the pitch is the most important, of course, but also off the pitch, if I can help, I will always try to, to help my teammates and the club in general, yeah, definitely. In de zoektocht naar meer stabiliteit is trainer John van het Schip enkele weken geleden geswitcht van 4-3-3 naar een 5-4-1 formatie. I think there's been some good things about it, you know. Um, there's been a little bit more stability within, within our defensive shape and defensive setup. Um, Again, could we improve? Yes, we can improve both on defending, but also on maybe creating a lot more and creating more chances up the up the other end. You know, but you know, it's, things don't change overnight. You need to work at them. You need to work every day for for a period of time. You know, you can't just change something and then everything becomes easy and everything's like magic and you start winning. And no, it doesn't. Doesn't football doesn't work like that? You know what? What you put in is what you get out. In my experience, you know, if you dedicate yourself to the sport and you, you give absolutely everything, then you will get your rewards in the end. Donderdag wacht voor Ajax de uitwedstrijd tegen Aston Villa. Voor Henderson betekent dat duel een terugkeer naar zijn vaderland. I'm looking forward to it, you know. I'm excited. It's, this is the reason, you know, you want to play football is to play in big matches and it will certainly be a, be a big European game. Um, Villa were a fantastic side, a really good team. We found that out last game, but we knew that before the game, really, when you look at the season, they have a really experienced manager in Europe as well, so it's, it'll be a tough, tough test, of course, um, but an opportunity to go out and try and perform against one of the most informed teams in Europe, um, again, and, and try and give everything. But you know Philip Park quite well, what can we expect? Yeah, you'll expect a good atmosphere, for sure. Um, they'll be right behind the team from the minute from minute one, um, and they're very passionate about football, passionate about the club. So it'll be, um, I'm sure sure it'll be a loud, a loud atmosphere, definitely. I think for us, it's just about performing. I think go there, perform to the best of your ability, give everything, and then let's see what happens. Because you know you're up against a very good side. Um, and it will be tough, it's a, it's a huge test, but we want to go there and you never know in football, you know, you can cause upsets. We've seen a lot of them in, in our time, I'm sure. So, you know, we want to just go there and, and give absolutely everything for the however long the game is and, um, and, and perform to the best of our ability.